Good afternoon, I'm Karen Swenson. And I'm Sheree Skipson. That three alarm fire at the Domino plant in Araby happened at one of the largest sugar refineries in the country. And today, investigators told our Danny Monteverdi what they know so far about what started it. The burn marks on the sugar silos at the Domino refinery are the only obvious signs of the scare that happened Thursday afternoon. Less obvious right now is why it happened. We have investigators that, that are there now trying to determine the cause. St. Bernard Parish Fire Chief Thomas Stone says investigators are not ruling out anything, with one exception. We're confident it wasn't intentionally said. It's an accidental fire. One possible culprit, lightning from storms that passed by during the afternoon. Sugar is big business in the United States, and Louisiana produces the second largest amount in the entire country. Much of that is produced here at the Domino factory in Araby. In a statement, American Sugar Refining, Domino's owner, says the loss of any sugar is minimal because the majority of the refinery's products are shipped to customers or outside warehouses as they're produced. A spokesman for the American Sugar Alliance, a trade industry, says that even if there had been a major loss of sugar, there are policies in place that allow for easy importing to keep the supply chain moving. This was a syrup paddle. Sugar production as we know it today began in Louisiana. Uh, particularly here in St. Bernard. St. Bernard Parish historian Bill Hyland says any major damage to the plant would have had major impacts on the parish. Since 1910, American Sugar Refinery, now Domino Sugar, has been a, a key element in the foundation of our economy. So it's vital to our future, it's vital to our present, and it's been vital to in our history. Reporting in Araby, Danny Monteverdi, Eyewitness News. Well, fortunately, no one was injured in that fire, which took about two hours to get under control.